As the city of St. Paul welcomes the Central Corridor light rail to University Avenue, some businesses along its path have been forced to shut their doors. I think eventually it's really going to benefit the Twin City area, but it's a matter of living through the construction. Barbara Hun has seen fewer customers at Key's restaurant since light rail construction began in May of this year. People only have so much time, especially in the morning getting to work, and to be, to be interfered with construction, of course, they're going to stay away from the area. The addition of the light rail to University Avenue has eliminated the on-street parking that businesses depend on for survival. For many businesses, when they did repaving, it knocked out both parking spaces and it made it very difficult simply to drive down the road. And for many businesses, that was enough to actually finish them off. The Metropolitan Council is offering more than $6 million in forgivable loans and grants to assist businesses along the Central Corridor. Anyone along University Avenue should absolutely get that 20000 without question because they are so totally affected by uh, what's happened. Community developers have suggested sharing parking space, reconfiguring existing lots, and eliminating curb cuts in response to parking issues. It's really sad because there's not, if you're on University Avenue, there's not much anybody can do for the business. For those who once occupied the now empty storefronts along the Central Corridor, assistance is too late. It would have been fair to the residents and the businesses for this to have been brought up right up front, even if it meant that they were at a slightly increased risk of the project not going through or having a delay. Todd Crotty, University Report. We are allowed a grant, uh, a forgivable grant, and it's up to $20,000. You know, you have to fill out a few forms, you bring it down to the office, 
they look it over and then they call you and tell you what you've been approved for. You know, because there's there's no place to park. And and during the construction, you know, you couldn't even go down university or, or you only had one lane. And a lot of these businesses along university, I'm on I'm on Raymond. I'm I'm so blessed to be, you know, a half a block off of the whole the main corridor. Um, I have made myself available parking spots in the back, which I which I rent out for my customers. After three o'clock, I tell Sherrits they can use it for their customers. So we that's how we kind of share on this corner here.